There were 41 conferences to be held throughout the world. Around 80,000 Baha'is and their friends from more than 170 countries attended these historic events. In the Pacific region, the conference was held in Auckland, New Zealand. The Baha'i faith is a world religion brought by Baha'u'llah, who the Baha'is believe is the latest prophet founder or manifestation of God. The purpose of these large gatherings was to highlight the shared vision of the Baha'is and for the proven courses of action that were being followed around the world to be consolidated. The Baha'i community responded with creativity and vigor. This conference featured a jubilant 2,000 participants from all over the South Pacific. They came together exploring and sharing stories of community building and neighborhood activities. So far, I think the conference is the best thing that's ever happened to me. This conference is like a heart. It's taking all the old blood and we're getting oxygenated and going back to give a bunch of energy back to our communities. To welcome overseas friends, the conference started with a Māori welcoming ceremony, a pohiri on the Manurewa Marae. Māori oratory is an ancient skill and their words facilitate a spiritual journey where heaven and earth are acknowledged and ancestors are remembered. The last elements of this formal ceremony sees the Māori hosts invite the manuhiri or guests to come forward and shake hands and hungi. This sharing of the breath signifies the joining together of tangata whenua and manuhiri and unity and spirit. It's been amazing just to see so many different people from all the Pacific and wanting to do the same thing together, unity and diversity really in action. The Baha'i world has succeeded in developing a culture which promotes a way of thinking, studying and acting in which all consider themselves as treading a common path of service, supporting one another and advancing together. Never in history has humanity had continual divine guidance after the Prophet has passed on. And now through Abdu'l Baha and then Shoghi Effendi and now today the Universal House of Justice, we have continual divine guidance and inspiration. But we don't have experts in the faith. We are all in this posture of learning and trying to understand. One of the highlights of this Pacific Baha'i conference was the concert where participants shared the wonderful music and arts from their home countries. This unforgettable night highlighted the spectacular beauty to be found in all cultures and bound the hearts together in unity and appreciation. Music is the best music in the whole world. <laughs> Come to the end of an amazing day. Weaponed with pure intent, with righteous motives with counsels helpful and effective, with godly attributes, with deeds pleasing to the Almighty, with the qualities of heaven. If tomorrow I should die, I will be happy. Here's a reason why some more me. It's beautiful. If thou lovest me, turn away from thyself, and if thou seekest my pleasure, God not thine own, if thou mayest thy enemy, and thou 